Good evening and welcome to Stations of the Cross, presented by the people of St. Luke's Episcopal Church here in New Haven, Connecticut. The uh, program book for tonight, if you'd like to follow along with the responses, should be on our website, uh, if not now, in a very few minutes. Let us begin. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us say together the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art, who art in, in heaven, heaven, hallowed, hallowed be, be thy, thy name. name. Thy, kingdom thy kingdom come, come. thy, thy will, will be done, done. On, earth on earth as it is, is in, heaven. in heaven. Give, Give us, us this day, day our daily, daily bread. bread. And forgive, and forgive us, us our, our trespasses, trespasses as we forgive, forgive those who trespass, trespass against us. us. And lead us, lead us not into temptation, temptation but, but deliver us, us from evil. We will glory in the cross of our Lord Jesus Christ, in whom is our salvation, our life, and resurrection. Let us pray. Assist us mercifully with your help, O Lord God of our salvation that we may enter with joy upon the contemplation of those mighty acts whereby you have given us life and immortality through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The first station. Jesus is condemned to death. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. As soon as it was morning, the chief priests with the elders and scribes and the whole council held a consultation and they bound jesus and led him away and delivered him to pilate and they condemned him and said he deserves to die when pilate heard these words he brought jesus out and sat down on the judgment seat at a place called the pavement but in the hebrew gabbatha then he handed Jesus over to them to be crucified. God did not spare his own son, but delivered him up for us all. Let us pray. Almighty God, whose most dear son went not up to joy, but first suffered pain, and entered not into glory before he was crucified, mercifully grant that we, walking in the way of the cross, may find it none other than the way of life and peace. Through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal, have mercy upon us. Second station. Jesus takes up his cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because, because by, by your, your holy cross, cross you have redeemed, redeemed the world. Jesus went out, bearing his own cross, to the place called the place of a skull, which is called in Hebrew, Golgotha. Although he was a son, he learned obedience through what he suffered. Like a lamb, he was led to the slaughter, and like a sheep that before its shearers is mute. So he opened not his mouth. Worthy is the lamb who was slain to receive power and riches and wisdom and strength and honor and glory and blessing. The Lord has laid on him the iniquity of us all. For, For the, the transgression, transgression of, of my, my people, people was, was he stricken. Let us pray. Almighty God, whose beloved Son willingly endure the agony and shame of the cross for our redemption. Give us courage to take up our cross and follow him, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. 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 Holy God. Holy God. 
so one have mercy upon us. The third station. Jesus falls the third time. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Christ Jesus, though he was in the form of God, did not count equality with God a thing to be grasped, but emptied himself, taking the form of a servant, and was born in human likeness. And being found in human form, he humbled himself and became obedient unto death, even death on a cross. Therefore, God has highly exalted him and bestowed on him the name which is above every name. Come, let us bow down and bend the knee and kneel before the Lord our maker, for he is the Lord our God. Surely he has borne our griefs and carried our sorrows. Let us pray. O oh God, you know us to be set in the midst of so many and great dangers that by reason of the frailty of our nature, we cannot always stand upright. Grant us such strength and protection as may support us in all dangers and carry us through all temptations. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. The fourth station, Jesus meets his afflicted mother. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. To what can I liken you? To what can I compare you, O daughter of Jerusalem? What likeness can I use to comfort you, O virgin daughter of Zion? For vast as the sea is your ruin, Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. The Lord will be, be your everlasting light, and your days of mourning shall be ended. A sword will pierce your own soul also. And fill your heart with bitter pain. Let us pray. O oh God, who willed that in the passion of your Son, a sword of grief should pierce the soul of the Blessed Virgin Mary, his mother. Merciful, mercifully grant that your church, having shared with her his passion, may be worthy to share in the joys of his resurrection, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, Holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. The fifth station. The cross is laid on Simon of Cyrene. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross, you have redeemed the world. As they led Jesus away, they came upon a man of Cyrene, Simon by name, who was coming in from the country and laid upon him the cross to carry it behind Jesus. If anyone would come after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow me. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Whoever does not bear his own cross and come after me cannot be my disciple. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, whose blessed Son came not to be served, but to serve, bless all who, following in his steps, give themselves to the service of others. 
that with wisdom, patience, and courage, they may minister in his name to the suffering, the friendless, and the needy. For the love of him who laid down his life for us, your Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. The sixth station, a woman wipes the face of Jesus. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross, you have redeemed the world. We have seen him without beauty or majesty, with no looks to attract our eyes. He was despised and rejected by men, a man of sorrows and acquainted with grief. And as one from whom men hide their faces, he was despised and we esteemed him not. His appearance was so marred beyond human semblance in his form beyond that of the children of men. But he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. Upon him was the chastisement that made us whole. And his strike, with his stripes, we are healed. Restore us, O Lord God of hosts. Show the light of your countenance and we shall be saved. Let us pray. O oh God, who before the passion of your only begotten Son revealed his glory upon the holy mountain, grant to us that we, beholding by faith the light of his countenance, may be strengthened to bear our cross and to be changed into his likeness from glory to glory through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Holy God, Holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. The seventh station, Jesus falls a second time. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross, you have redeemed the world. Surely he has borne our griefs and carried our sorrows. All we like sheep have gone astray. We have turned every one to his own way. And the Lord has laid on him the iniquity of us all. He was oppressed and he was afflicted, yet he opened not his mouth. For the transgression of my people was he stricken. But as for me, I am a worm and no man, scorned by all and despised by the people. Let us pray. Almighty and ever living God, in your tender love for the human race, you sent your son, our savior, Jesus Christ, to take upon him our nature and to suffer death upon the cross, giving us the example of his great humility. Mercifully grant that we may walk in the way of his suffering and also share in his resurrection, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, Holy Immortal One, have mercy upon us. The eighth station, Jesus meets the women of Jerusalem. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross, you have redeemed the world. There followed after Jesus a great multitude of the people. And among them were women who bewailed and lamented him. But Jesus, turning to them, said, Daughters of Jerusalem, do not weep for me, but weep for yourselves and for your children. Those who sowed with tears will reap with songs of joy. 
Let us pray. Teach your church, O Lord, to mourn the sins of which it is guilty and to repeat and forsake them, that by your pardoning grace, sorry, to repent and forsake them, that by your pardoning grace, the results of our iniquities may not be visited upon our children and our children's children. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. The ninth station, Jesus falls a third time. We adore you, O Christ. And we bless you. Because by your holy cross, you have redeemed the world. I am the man who has seen affliction under the rod of his wrath. He has driven and brought me into darkness without any light. He has besieged me and enveloped me with bitterness and tribulation. He has made me dwell in darkness like the dead of long ago. Though I call and cry for help, he shuts out my prayer. He has made my teeth grind on gravel and made me cower in ashes. Remember, O Lord, my affliction and bitterness, the wormwood and the gall. He was led like a lamb to the slaughter. And like a sheep that before its shears is mute, so he opened not his mouth. Let us pray. O oh God, by the passion of your blessed Son, you made an instrument of shameful death to be for us the means of life. Grant us so to glory in the cross of Christ that we may gladly suffer shame and loss for the sake of your Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. The tenth station. Jesus is stripped of his garments. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. When they came to a place called Golgotha, which means the place of a skull, they offered him wine to drink, mingled with gall. But it, when he tasted it, he would not drink it. And they divided his garments among them by casting lots. This was to fulfill the scripture, which says, they divided my garments among them. They cast lots for my clothing. They gave me gall to eat. And when I was thirsty, they gave me vinegar to drink. Let us pray. Lord God, whose blessed Son, our Savior, gave his body to be whipped and his face to be spit upon, give us grace to accept joyfully the sufferings of the present time, confident of the glory that shall be revealed through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. The 11th station. Jesus is nailed to the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross, you have redeemed the world. When they came to the place which is called the skull, there they crucified him. 
and with him they crucified two criminals, one on the right, the other on the left, and Jesus between them. And the scripture was fulfilled, which says, he was numbered with the transgressors. They pierce my hands and my feet. They stare and gloat over me. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you stretched out your arms of love on the hard wood of the cross that everyone might come within the reach of your saving embrace. So clothe us in your spirit that we, reaching forth our hands in love, may bring those who do not know you to the knowledge and love of you. For the honor of your name. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. The twelfth station, Jesus dies on the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. When Jesus saw his mother and the disciple whom he loved standing near, he said to his mother, Woman, behold your son. And then to the disciple, Behold your mother. And when Jesus had received the vinegar, he said, It is finished. And then, Crying with a loud voice, he said, Father, into your hands I commend my spirit. And he bowed his head and handed over his spirit. Christ came for us, Christ for us became obedient unto death even death on a cross. Let us pray. O oh God, who for our redemption gave his, your only begotten son to the death of the cross, by his glorious resurrection delivered us from the power of our enemy. Grant us so to die daily to sin, that we may evermore live with him in the joy of his resurrection, who lives and reigns now and forever. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. The 13th station. The body of Jesus is placed in the arms of his mother. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross, you have redeemed the world. All you who pass by, behold and see if there is any sorrow like my sorrow. My eyes are spent with weeping. My soul is in tumult. My heart is poured out in grief because of the downfall of my people. Do not call me Naomi, which means pleasant. Call me Mara, which means bitter. For the Almighty has dealt very bitterly with me. Her tears run down her cheeks. And she has none to comfort her. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, by your death you took away the sting of death. Grant to us, your servants, so to follow in faith where you have led the way, that we may at length fall asleep peacefully in you and wake up in your likeness, for your tender mercy's sake. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, 
Holy Immortal One, have mercy upon us. The 14th station, Jesus is laid in the tomb. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. When it was evening, there came a rich man from Arimathea named Joseph, who was also a disciple of Jesus. He went to Pilate and asked for the body of Jesus. Then Pilate ordered it to be given to him. And Joseph took the body and wrapped it in a clean linen shroud and laid it on in his own new tomb, which he had hewn in the rock. And he rolled a great stone to the door of the tomb. You will not abandon me to the grave. Nor let your Holy One see corruption. Let us pray. O oh God, your blessed Son was laid in a tomb in a garden and rested on the Sabbath day. Grant that we who have been buried with him in the waters of baptism may find our perfect rest in his eternal and glorious kingdom, where he lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. Savior of the world, by your cross and precious blood, you have redeemed us. Save, Save us and help, and help us. us. We, we humbly, humbly beseech you, you O oh Lord. Oh Lord. Let us pray. We thank you, Heavenly Father, that you have delivered us from the dominion of sin and death and brought us into the kingdom of your Son. And we pray that, as by his death he recalled us to life, so by his love he may rise us to eternal joys, who lives in, brings with you, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. 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 To Christ our Lord, who loves us, and washed us in his own blood, and made us a kingdom of priests to serve his God and Father, to him be glory and dominion for ever and ever. Amen. 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 Okay, we stopped the live stream now. Okay. <laughs> so, um, I thought that went really well. I thought the same thing. Yeah. You know, uh, the, uh, from my perspective, that... the only thing we had to learn was that only one person should do a response at a time, at a time. because they're just they're they're not in the same time, no matter how hard you try. So, if, yeah. if more than one person speaks, it doesn't work. Um, yep. And I finally figured out how to do the slideshow about halfway through. <laughs> I, w I was enjoying the slides. Those are beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Um, they are. Absolutely beautiful. Um, Father, did you like the way we, Valerie and I, just kind of um, tag teamed on the singing? Cause, I thought you know. that was very wonderful. Um, and, uh, I told you I can't start it without her because yeah, you know, because I would have been like holy God yeah. that's, that's my style of singing yeah. so you know um, I'm, I think we did good on this uh, yeah so. I think so also uh, and Valerie um, that background that you have you like uh, it yeah no I'm so jealous you know it's yeah. just like mine is you know as you could see my my um, Venetian blinds, which look out to my front yard, which are closed now because it's nighttime and you can't see anything. Right. Yeah. But, you know, I'm, I'm that kind of simplistic person. I don't have curtains and all that. It's just blinds. So, so this, yeah. is what you, this is what, what you get. What you get. Yep. John, John Hanneman, the other night we were on, I guess it was the finance committee call. Oh, jo uh, Jeff? Jeff. Uh, Jeff. Jeff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, he sent me a private message and said, 
So, Valerie, is that your house behind you? <laughs> <laughs> I wish. <laughs> no. You should have said. You should have said yes. Come on by. Courtyard and one of Yale University's resident anthropologists. He's like, oh yes, 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 yes. Okay. No, it's just right. my. It's my cottage at the beach. It's yeah. Right. <laughs> So when we do the stations on Good Friday, do you want to just re reprise this, or do you want to have other people read as well? Well, um, haven't you already sent out a, a message asking for electors to be part of it? I'm not on that no. list, so I don't know what's been sent out. So that that's for the um, the passion, Lisa, not for the... Um... Oh, not for 12 o'clock? It's for 12 o'clock, but it's, it's not for, for stations, as I understood right. it. I don't yes. care. I mean, whatever you guys want to do, I'm happy with. Yeah, it was for the, um, I think the acts was for the uh, reading of the passion. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, yeah that's right. right. For um, Palm Sunday. Right. Yeah. Yep. Uh, for Good Friday. For, for Good no, Friday. for Good Friday. Okay, I'm confused we're not, again. We're not doing the passion for Palm Sunday. Okay. Only for Good Friday. Yeah. At 12 o'clock. Yes. And in between, so Father, you want to explain that we talked about this the other night that then um, we'll do it differently. I think after in the middle of the service, Father, is I think what you said that we would we would stop and do the station, so it'll be a little different. Yeah. And then resume. Yeah. And so, well, we can yeah, do we're gonna, the station. We're going zoom, like to zoom through the whole thing. Whole yeah, yeah. So like, re resume is what yeah. I said. Yeah. Meaning, <laughs> and what we've Continue. done is there's a part of the service where you usually bring in a cross and everybody sits there for a while yeah. and looks at it. And, and well, no, no. Normally they, people no. will go up and kiss it and, and yeah. kneel. And kneel and, and, yeah, but, yeah. Yeah. We so, can't do uh, that. As, so, right. So we'll ask yeah. them we're to show a picture of a cross for a while and then we're going to do stations of the cross and then okay. we're going to do the, the, the cross hymn with more pictures of a cross. And then we'll be moving right back into whatever else we do with the service. Yeah, no, that's just that sounds It'll like work. a plan. Yeah, so. so I think this worked well. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Yeah. All right. So okay. since I have you both here, let me just clarify. This Sunday we are going to be in this in the sanctuary. Yep. Correct. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that's a it, Facebook Live one camera thing with no zooming at all. Okay, because Marcia was supposed to be um, subdeacon this Sunday, but she's um, she she said that you know because of concerns that her husband has, et cetera, mm -hmm. that she's not going to be able to do it. So I I am gonna fill, I'm gonna be subdeacon this Sunday and for Easter Sunday. Okay. Yeah. So I just so I just, I just needed to know whether I should show up or not. Yeah. 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 Okay. Can we also clarify, um, Lisa is going to be subdeacon, so is she doing all the readings except the prayers of the people, or do we need another reader? If if we have another reader who shows up, they can do the readings and the prayers of the people. If we don't have another reader who shows up... Okay, we okay well, I can show up. Okay. That's all right. That. So okay. we're all set for that. And then we need people, we need um, a reader and a, and a thoroughfare slash acolyte for um, uh, the first Mass of Easter at 8 o'clock on Saturday night. So, okay. And yeah. then we have Easter Sunday. And after that, we're probably going to go to doing Zoom worship for a while. Um, mm -hmm. Arigit, uh is going to join us by Zoom on Good Friday, but cannot join us uh, on uh, Holy Saturday for the first Mass of Easter because his mother won't let him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so Alex is going to play hey. that. Hey, you got to listen to Mama. That's that's yeah. right. <laughs> and then um, and then uh, Easter Sunday, your Regent will be back, and hopefully between now and Good Friday, I'll have be able to figure out what we do for the second Sunday of Easter because um, I really haven't looked at that yet, but. Um, right now, all of the worship books are done and ready to go, as far as I know, through Easter Sunday. So that's that's good. Okay. Yep. That's good. All right. Well, thank you both very much. I know this was a leap of faith, but I think we pulled it off. I think we pulled it off. Do we know how many people so were uh, watching? Because I, I wasn't paying attention. No. Um, well, we couldn't tell because... No. 
I, um, I suppose we, it, we couldn't it, tell because we're on Zoom, so we right. can tell. I think it will pick up as as time goes on, and I think um, if we uh, were to do this again, uh, just to get a more polished version, that it would live well on the internet. But let's who who needs polished? <laughs> this is us. This is us. That's fine. This is us. This, this is, is us. us. This feel, is as good as it gets. <laughs> well, no, I, I feel a little bad because I sort of flubbed the order of the slides a couple of times. Um, but you know what? I didn't notice. I don't think Valerie noticed. No, and I'm sure no one else did. Yeah. It's, you know, it's it's for the most part, it's it's us. It's our family. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, and I think we're just family and we love each other. We know none of us are perfect. Okay. So, I'm, I'm happy uh, with that. I'm happy yeah. with that. Uh, and Father Jackson, like I put in the chat room before Valerie uh, came on. Um, the part where you said you, know, you hit your husband? I, I said, like um, like I put in the chat room with you before Valerie came on. Mm -hmm. um, you know, normally uh, when I'm on a Zoom meeting, and Valerie can attest to this because she does the same thing, normally it just says L. Yarber. Mm -hmm. There's like no picture whatsoever. And yeah. Valerie, Valerie doesn't even have her name. It's just a phone number that shows up. Yeah. So the fact that the fact that both of us got dressed and, and like showed up yeah, visually yeah. visually, that, that that's a huge accomplishment. <laughs> I appreciate that. I think it added a lot. Okay, well I'm, I'm, Alex made pizza and had it ready half hour ago, so I'm going to go down he made pizza? He makes pizza. Mm. You know, he okay. he makes the bro, he raises the dough, he stretches it out, he has a second. Very order. nice. Um, well, I, I have catfish sitting here next to me. Okay, well, I'm going to let you go have your catfish. And I and I, you really do have the best the best uh, background. Um, yeah, you do. <laughs> find, where, where is my Whereas background? people see it, they're asking, how do you do that? Where, how do you like that? So, yeah. yeah, I'm going to have to figure something out for the next time. Yeah. Well, this this is the best I can do. Oh, see, you have one too. That's not fair. All right. Well, you know, all you have to do is look at the program. I mean, you just upload a picture. Yeah. Um, the problem with mine is that I need to get a green screen because my hair is so white that it starts to look like I'm on fire. Yeah, it was. <laughs> well, it works for Pentecost, but you know, <laughs> I'm not good right now. But, but Valerie, actually, um, on your left side, below your ear. There's a little um, see-through going on there. It's not it's not major, but there, yeah, there's a little see-through there. But yeah. there. See, now it's perfect. That was perfect. Yep. Uh, but yeah, I just had to pick at you. But okay. all right, Father Jackson, okay. enjoy your pizza. Valerie, enjoy your cat bitch. Yep. I'm yep. gonna go enjoy whatever it is my husband made. I don't know what it is yet. Whatever but... it is, you will enjoy it. Yeah. Yeah, Father Jackson, I just want you to know, mm -hmm. um, my husband was threatening to sit on the the steps and yodel. Yes. So. Um, I said he could do that as long as he harmonized. But he, but he, but he doesn't trust me. He doesn't. Okay. So I'm so glad he behaved himself. I actually called Valerie, put her on speakerphone, and said, "Can you please talk my husband off the ledge?" Mm -hmm. This was like 15 minutes before we started. Okay. Well, so. I'm glad that the marital bliss abounds in your household. Okay. It does. All right. All right. Bye, guys. Bye. 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 Have a good one.